name is Steve Maher. I'm a physical therapist and founder of Sight Solutions. And I'm here with my director, Maurice, today inside the cockpit or the, the first class cabin of a 747. And I'd like to talk to you a little bit about how to work on an airplane because a lot of people are traveling. You have your laptop or your iPad and what do you do? And luckily we're in first class so it's actually pretty nice and there's a lot of extra room a lot of times when I'm flying I'm flying on Southwest and things change a little bit but there are a few few things that you can do to make working in the airplane a little more comfortable and a little more efficient so let me pull out my laptop and uh, thanks Maurice so when you're working on your laptop the problem typically is there's not enough space to work here um, especially if this guy leans his chair back, what happens is you're, you're basically here and you're all crunched up. So the first thing you wanna do is when you're sitting, make sure that you're sitting in a good posture. Um, in some of the other videos, I've used a binder. What you can do is get the little pillow that they, 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 uh, they give you. It's basically paper thin, but what you can do is take your pillow, put it here, and sit on it and what that's going to do it's going to raise your hips a little bit and allow you to sit in a more neutral posture so you're a little more supported what happens a lot is people will take that pillow jam it into their low back but if they don't change their base of support it just puts more stress on their low back so get in a position where you're sitting comfortably it's hard to take pillows with you so ask the stewardess or the steward for a uh, for a pillow to get in this neutral position then when you pull out your laptop um, the, these uh, tray tables don't come out, but what you can do is put the laptop on your lap here, relax your shoulders, bend your elbows about 90 degrees, keep your wrists straight so you're typing here, and then you're looking down at the screen. Okay. What you can do is take your, your bag or something or whatever you have, put it on your lap to elevate the laptop a little bit more um, again try and keep your wrists in a good neutral position and then play with the position of the screen so that you can see it comfortably um, what we see in coach a lot is you have to work on the little tray table that flips down here so your laptop is typically too high when you go to open it you can't see it so what you really want to do as much as possible is bring this in closer to you put it on your lap so that your shoulders are relaxed your wrists are straight and then just push the monitor back so you can sit like this usually not a good idea to have your seat reclined too far because then you're sitting too far away and you're doing more reaching so keep your seat straight um, position the keyboard here and the monitor below eye level so you can look down at it comfortably all right so those are just some ideas for you when you're traveling on an airplane um, hopefully you'll be in first class um, but if not you can apply those things for a coach as well thank you very much for your time and for more information contact us at info at site thank you <music>